welcome to my YouTube channel. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Um, so as you can see from the title of the video today, I'm doing um a video, a makeup video, and I'm showing you guys like my go-to makeup look, which is this one. I'm showing you guys my go-to makeup look. I won't even lie to y'all. I look cute. <laughs> Um, so if you are interested to see what products I'm really, um, like running for whenever I'm in the store, especially during this time, um, definitely check that out, check this video out, and I hope you guys love my new branding. I'm rebranded, baby girl! I will leave all the links down below of the person who I actually was in contact with, and if you guys are interested in rebranding, definitely this is not even like um, a, a partnership or anything, but they hooked me up. Did you see? I know. So if you are keen, definitely just click um, in my description box. I've left her details down below. Follow her on Instagram as well. That's actually where I managed to find her. And yeah, guys, let's get straight into the video. Like, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let's go, Bora. Get la la. <laughs> so yeah, let's get straight into the video. Right, guys, so I've already done my brows. And I've actually already done the eyeshadow base i was using the la girl this is the one i use all the time this is the la girl pro conceal um concealer in cool tan so i'm just gonna redo it a little because i feel like i've actually i haven't gone in on it that well i'm just gonna do one eye on camera and then i'm gonna should i do both uh-uh let's just do one then i'll do the other one off camera just to save some time so as you can see i have basically created a clean canvas on my eyelid and the palette that i will be using this is the one palette that i actually use quite a bit is the juvia's place masquerade mini palette um and this is how the shades look you can already see i've hit pan already quite a few times you see so this is the one palette that I use all the time. I'm actually, I didn't bring my eyeshadow brushes close by. So I'm just going to do the usual eyeshadow look that I would do. And it's going to be including this shade, which they don't have names. So it's this shade, this shade, and then a bit of the brown. So it's these three shades, sorry, that I'm going to be working on. All right. Oh. If you got to this point, you must have seen. Boom, duh. Um, I ended up using my finger on the brown to kind of deepen the brown a little because I must be honest, um, the brush that I was using was not doing what it needed, and I needed a bit like a bit of a like I needed to get a little darker. You get what I mean? So I used my finger, and that actually always just helps me a lot more. Um, from there I would sometimes going with a winged eye and if i'm going to be doing um that i will be going in with the liquid ink eyeliner and i think i'm going to do it yeah i think i'm going to be doing it i'll try to do it no i'm going to do it off camera and then i'll come back after okay so i went a little crazy on the eyeliner do forgive me but um if i'm gonna go out i'm most probably gonna do a really dramatic eyeliner um and if i'm gonna like go to something a little more calm and a little more a little more relaxed i'm definitely gonna tone it down but we're at home where am i going 
so I might as well just live with what I did um so that is the eyeshadow look I'm gonna be running through the foundation because it's my usual foundation routine however I will be just showing you the products so you can see what products I'm using today um and yeah enjoy So did you see how I put on the face and then I actually had to remove it? But also, the products that I'm using now, um, you guys, if you watch my other videos, you'll know that I'm really in love with the Can't Stop Bone Stop Foundation from NYX. But this is a close second for me only because, number one, it doesn't make me feel like cakey. And I have dry skin, so it says here it's for normal to oily skin. And yet on my skin, I feel a little bit more... I don't feel matte and um since it's wintery vibes autumn vibes this is genuinely something that i'm really enjoying at the moment the next one is a matte constant bone stop foundation it's matte and like in this weather it's not that i wouldn't use it but i would definitely probably run for this one first um and also i'm at home so you can't judge which foundation i use at the moment um it, like my temperatures are basically used to this kind of temperature that's at home so that's why but anyway um that's my foundation done i'm going on to concealer <music> infallible concealer for me is honestly the best thing to ever come at the moment to clicks or disclaim um because well i haven't actually tried a couple if i'm being completely honest so it's the best for me um and it's really full coverage like do you guys see anything under my eyes no i know you don't see anything under my eyes and my eyes are a little baggy right now like because i haven't been sleeping very well um but like it covers up all that darkness like excuse me um and then i'm gonna be powderishing with the revlon candid setting powder this is honestly one of my go-to's at the moment um and this is in the shade three only because um during this time i tend to go for a little bit more of a darker like less beat face so yeah this one really does that for me the three is also pretty awesome but um i'm just going for like a super like cute look the lighter version is a little like beat you gotta be beat yeah yeah beat shanji so yeah <laughs>
right so um for contour i felt like i should probably just talk to you guys about the products instead of just saying these are my go-to you know it's the contouring glow palette from what's this thing scarlet Be scarlet heel this is honestly the the one thing i was honestly missing currently um but soon we're gonna try some look at that guys excuse me am i not contoured don't play with me you playing you are playing come on you're playing i mean You're honestly playing if you're not using this product. Excuse me, but you're playing. For all time's sake. I mean, cut it, cut it, cut it, and a lot of the highlight hasn't been, you know, blended in very well. I'm gonna use the Mac Mineralize Skin Finish Neutral Dry 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 Powder, and I'm gonna use that to blend in all of this. to contour my nose i just highlighted my nose which is looking pretty good already and sometimes i really do forget but i'm going to be using this shade which is waja and i'm just gonna create a bit of a because this thing is pretty pigmented you know And I'm just gonna cover my nose. Do y'all see how pigmented this is? She like ikalalam like lim. Like my nose is so snatched now. Woo! My god, my nose. My nose. And then I'm gonna go back in this one. Just to make sure we ain't too snatched. All right, so I'm just blending in everything with a beauty blender. Um, my nose looks hella snatched, snatched, but we look cute. And we look like we look like we should be going places okay i always hurt myself with that statement and it's not cute it's not helpful anyway to set my face because i've now done almost everything i don't really do um, blush but i use the scarlet heels palette the much lighter shade to let me just put this down the much lighter shade to almost bronze out and still do a bit of blush but when i smile nothing happens like no beaming thing happens but in time guys so this is my go-to uh setting spray when i know i'm gonna be going places and i'm gonna probably like if it's hot if i go somewhere and i need something for long lasting glow long lasting looks you know however 
um i am very interested in this one product and i think i'm going to try my best to get it so i can shoot with it and we'll see um so this is the lasting fix spray from maybe maybe let me just give it a bit of a shake all right so on to my highlight um my go-to highlight right now is the contour and glow highlighting i mean palette um and these are the two i mix them together i use the one somewhere i use the other somewhere else depending on how i'm feeling for the day <sighs> yeah so i'm just gonna do that After that dramatic situation that happened on my face I'm so not over it because I look different I don't know maybe you guys don't see it but I see it man I don't know maybe something caught on something and something not caught on something else and then that situation happened and then for my go-to lip situation combo paste don't wine um, I'm all about the LA Girl at the moment. I'm all about the LA Girl uh, lip liner in the shade Chocolate. Alright, and then... I'm all about this Maybelline, like, this Maybelline cream lipstick. It even smells good, guys. That's a, that's a sign from God that you need to get this. Okay, and this is in the shade or color Rosy Risk. <music> Excuse me, what do you even mean? And then I like to top this all off with the Essence Shine 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 lip gloss. I literally have a spare one, we're ready for usage, but we're still pretty good on the old one. And like when I went to clicks the other day and this came, I didn't find it. So basically, the next time I go, I'm definitely looking because I need this. All right, let me quickly just go put on my lashes. Um, my go-to lashes at the moment are an AliExpress vendor. Um, I actually finished the whole pack. Let me just show you all what they look like because a lot of people have asked me. This is what they look like but when they when they come in the pack this is the pack this is how it looks i really like to buy those um but i really need to start using south african vendors because like eyelash vendors because honestly i gotta support our own so yeah let me quickly put on my lashes and i'll be All right guys so this is the finished look i keep looking there because i feel like i look weird i don't know but i like this look um so this is really just uh the go-to products that I would go for if, like, I want to look really, really nice, but still, like, presentable. So, like, a really serious beat, but, like, super chilled. And I also did the under, I put black liner, and then I just used the same colors that I had on top at the bottom, um, except for the brown. And um, I, re I fixed my winged eye a little, because remember when we were working... It kind of removed itself 
and i just went for a super chilled like look i don't know i feel like my hair looks a little messy though i don't know i did like a little bit of a wavy situation i don't know how i feel about it i don't know you guys tell me in the comment section what you're thinking about this look but i think it's cute i think it's also very different from like the usual either side bang or you know it's like super chilled i just wanted a super wavy look i won't lie to y'all i keep saying super okay but this is the finished look if you really enjoyed it please do give it a thumbs up and um comment and subscribe to my youtube channel um we have grown a little bit more so i'm really happy about that and um i really hope you enjoyed this i hope you guys like my um my look i don't know i don't know oh when it's like this do y'all see this liner with these look at this ah my gosh i look so good never mind i look good i was gonna i was gonna want to change no I don't need to change anything. I love this look so much. And I haven't done my makeup in like a week. So I'm really happy about that. And my wig looks pretty much like my hair. So. I keep looking at my mirror. Because I feel like I look so cute. Um, If you enjoyed this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. I trashed my eyeshadow palette so when I was doing the bottom liner I want to do this till the little do y'all see my purple is shattered my heart is so sore but it's okay I feel like I look so nice I hope my mom wants to go to the store okay anyway um yeah guys this is all my go-to products this is how I would achieve a normal look if i'm gonna go somewhere with people um if i need to be somewhere and um it's like a daytime not a daytime actually anytime except for when you like want a really no makeup makeup look like situation like a natural makeup look but other than that this is my go-to look guys like i really love this i like it so yeah thank you for getting to this point don't forget to like comment share like do everything that is necessary let's get me to a hundred subscribers guys see close see really really do you see how i keep using this like because i want to i want you guys to see the highlight see really 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 close let's get to you know 100 um and yeah guys thank you so much for watching Let me show you guys a slow-mo of how I look now. Mm.